everyone, and let's make another episode. Maybe I'll be able to upload these when I go out later today or something. But I had to take the PSAT earlier. This is my second time taking it, and my, like, proctor person was kind of retarded. She was, like, this French lady, and, like, during, just, like, for five minutes during one of the, you know, parts, she, like, starts calling someone. Doesn't, like, leave the room or, I don't know what I expected her to do, but just not call people during the test, I guess. But, whatever. Wow, we are not taxing the rich... Stupid AI messed up my thing. Just see my administration. It's not good. That's, that's annoying. I just changed all the things that I didn't like. Because I know I need more because I want keep more of those. And also, we can see how many people signed up to be capitalists. So yeah, we're, we're getting more capitalists signing up. Every day. So yeah, the conservatives are losing ground to the liberals. But cool, discovery. Tariff would be good. Ugh. I guess it didn't fix that really. The um stupid policy of closing down the factories like that. So I'm gonna replace the political party. You know, it'll probably work better if we have more, um, more, what's it called? Uh, let's do this. If we have more capitalists, they'll be able to keep up the factories better and open them when they close and stuff like that. But for now, you know, we'll just I'll help them out. Okay, we got something. The Statuto Albertino. So, the Albertine Statute was a constitution enacted in the Kingdom of Sardinia, Piedmont, in response to concerning revolutionary activity in the country on the 4th of March, 1848. The statute formalized the absolute monarchy of Sardinia, Piedmont, Piedmont I guess, um, and would later be used, although in modified forms, as the basis for the Italian constitution all the way up until 1948. Peace offer. So Austria won. They have this little place of land like I told you they would. And you know, oh, they did invade with the land army. I thought they had just been blockading stuff. If we look at what wars are continuing, the only one is there, and Russia's not going to be able to take out a chunk of England. But Brazil 
Oh, I guess they lost. Yeah, they were trying to take out this region. But, yeah, Brazil lost the war. Oh well, doesn't matter. But we can... Oh no, we already are building railroads out here. And I can... Can I build them on my... I can build them in colonial places. Dutch reactionaries. Oh, alright, so we got a rebellion. Don't worry, these guys are probably going to be pretty easy to put down. The um, update changed how um, rebels work. They no longer try to... Um, like, just have one unit pop up at a time, I think. Now it's like a whole army, which is better and less annoying for the player. But yeah, we're gonna slaughter them. So, yeah. yeah sorry about that. But almost a 10 to 1 slaughter thing for them. Just kill. Another holy site has been disturbed. Why are there so many holy sites here? If they're mostly, you know, like, Muslims anyway, wouldn't their holy sites be back in Arabia? Oh, never mind, it's natives. So... Prussia is actually kind of close to unifying Germany. They still have to get, um, they have to take this land. But, after that, and that's good, I guess, you know, because we're allies with Prussia. Yeah, we're, we're their friends. We don't like Austria. You know, we have a... doing pretty well here. Not much has happened recently, but, you know, soon I will... Uh, sorry about that. Um, this is readjusting myself in my chair and I yanked my headset off. But anyway, soon we'll continue the industrialization of our country. And like I said earlier, this game isn't really just about, um... like, conquering everything. It's not like... Oh. Peace is happening. But you can't just, like, uh, conquer countries because of your infamy and stuff. So, the point is to create your country realistically into the best country in the world. Which I kind of like, and I kind of don't like at the same time. Yeah, our factories are doing. But yeah, you see, they've all recovered. Well, all but that one. And they can... I'm gonna upgrade that factory. Flandern. Just here, so yeah, they're building the cement factory bigger, which will allow me to take more, um, what's it called? I'll have more workers there.
So, all right, Spain wants another region from Morocco. This one here, the Sawira one. They're gonna take that pretty easily. Actually, Morocco is starting to invade because Spain doesn't have any armies over here. Kind of a bad decision on their part to declare war when they're not ready like that. Unless, you know, I don't know. But you know, that's probably all Morocco has. Another liberal students association. Another holy site has been disturbed. So in this place, once again, they're mostly Muslims. Cool. More population growth, which is what we need. More men to work the factories. And also, I think I explained this already, but RGOs, like basically farms, you know, you can't have an unlimited amount of farms because you don't have that much land. But you can get a lot of people working in the factories, a lot more than you can on RGOs. But, you know, we're not really facing the problem of the RGOs filling up yet. Most places could still fit a lot more people. And then they can start moving to the colonies also, which you know, a lot of them, well, some are actually kind of filling up, but a lot of them don't have, I mean, a lot of them have a lot more space, like this one, I mean, we could fit a lot more here. Let's fix our budget, actually. Why did I lose my alliance with Brazil? Oh, France declared war on them just now. But I don't know if that was before or after my alliance with them. So anyway, I don't know what their terms are. What is it? They want Paris. Oh no, Para, sorry. And yeah, they were not justified in demanding that. So France is looking to expand their colonial possessions here. I have to keep checking this because I want to. If one of the factories gets too good, I want to take it off of subsidies and make it work harder itself. Like this one. Uh, I'm getting a call. I'll be right back.